Hello guys, today we'll be explaining the whole Coraline story. I've watched the Theorizer's videos, he is amazing with them, I've done my own theory, what if it was all fake? If you watch, if you didn't watch it yet, go watch it. It was a theory explaining that what if the bow down was still real, but Coraline made it all up just to escape her reality of depression, sadness, and loneliness, and like, you know, just all that. But today... I'll be, if it is all real, I will be explaining the story. In the, in the mid-day 1800s, um, uh, a girl moves in with her son called the Baldam in this town. She has them build apartments for her called the Pink Palace. But then her son dies. She gets sad. Later on, she falls in a well, like, you know, years later. She, she goes to the afterlife, can't find her son, gets lonely. She, um, um, she, um, uh, creates this, and then, you know, she gets lonely, she's down there alone, creates this world to lure kids in, 1928, a girl moves in, and has a depressing life, this, the bow down, or the girl who fell in the well, in her afterlife, makes a doll of this girl, spies on her, um, uh, you know, takes her in, Gives her treats and joys of whatever she wants. Asks her to sew button eyes. She does. She throws her in a cage. Takes her soul. Eats her alive. And then... 1930s, a boy moves in. Same thing happens to him. 1960s, a boy moves in. Then years later, a girl named Coraline Jones moves in. Her life is depressing. And she gets the same. Except for this time, she outsmarts the Baldum. She locks the door. Throws the key into the well where she could never find it. And you pretty much know the stuff that I skipped about Coraline's life and all that. You've seen the um, other theories, like not have done by me, but of people, colors and stuff. So you pretty much know the rest, what I skipped. So that's, I know this was a very short video. It's just I wanted to get the Coraline thing from my point of view. You know the stuff that I skipped. If you, if you have it, then go watch other videos of people explaining Easter eggs and all that. And then you can add that into my theory of the stuff I skipped. And I will see you in the next video for Coraline. Oh, and Theorizer, that guy, you, whoever, I won't forget your channel's name, but you do the videos on Coraline. Your videos are amazing. I watched some of part seven and I will be watching part eight. And I will see you in the next video, guys, of Coraline or anything else. Bye-bye.